on the Monotepu bike ride, another climb, another little pinchy climb to do, adding to our vertical meters, uh, cramp. That's if you haven't had it by now, you're probably going to have it at this hill or somewhere along the way. Uh, Andy, have you had any cramp today? No, no, I'm pretty well. Oh, yeah, oh, good job. Yeah. yeah, historical old well-conditioned machine, you know, <laughs> yeah. chugging right. along at the, the pace it can handle. It's, yeah, exactly. But, um, all of my food and fluids, I guess, are helping. Yeah, but I, the legs are starting to feel it. Yeah, yeah. I, like I think number one is intensity in terms of cramp. Like, have you trained at the intensity you're riding at? And we've just been cruising today, so for you, that's probably the key reason why you haven't had any cramp. True. Yep. Yeah, we are just cruising along, and that's that is why we're feeling the way we are, yep. which is good. I'm, I, I'd have to say I'm an expert in cramp because I probably don't train enough and I race at the intensity that I'm always used to so therefore the body goes oh what are you doing to me and then ping so think about cramp as a neuromuscular thing where the nerves hit the muscles and the whole lot just seizes up so if you have trained at the intensity and duration that you're going to race at you'll probably be fine so think along the lines of Olympians uh, a marathon runner they don't have cramp because yeah. they've trained and they're at that level but uh, weekend warriors hey not as much training as we probably could do and uh, that's where we start running into problems. Yeah, they're fine-tuned machines, mm. and um, that is what their body is conditioned for, so yep. I guess it is what we condition yep. bodies for. Yep, so as we're climbing this hill, uh, are we used to pushing? Are we used to pushing our bike up a hill, something like that, and those calf muscles working? So so whatever your training's going to be, you want to, whatever your race is going to be, try and simulate that in training, both the intensity, the duration, the nutrition, the, yep. the hills and things like that as best as you can, and then you'll have a good day out, and they're slightly to cramp and... Yep. Uh, and struggle along. Let your body know what it's in for before it gets shocked with it. Yep. Yeah. And that last thing on cramp stop, does it work? Well, if you think it does, it probably does. If you don't think it does, it might not. So um, use it if you feel like it's a, of use. But number one is intensity and duration and getting those muscles conditioned to what you're used to. Yeah, absolutely.